As we enter the evening, we are still awaiting the opening of a new temporary migrant shelter in the city of Juarez. Once it does open, it will be able to house around 300 people. But as ABC 7's Juarez correspondent Heriberto Perez reports, only families will be allowed to stay. The city of Juarez will build the details on how this new migrant camp will be operating. Only migrant families will be accepted for a short time period. No es que las personas lleguen aquí al campamento, pidan alojamiento y, e ingresen. The city's director of human rights, Santiago González, said migrants arriving to the new temporary camp only asking for asylum will not be accepted. He also said in the last few weeks when we started to see the influx of migrants, authorities have not denied them a stay at local shelters. But this new temporary facility will be different. Familias rescatadas del bordo, del aeropuerto, precos y el tren. Para ese es el, es el objetivo de este espacio. The new camp is designed only for migrant families, families rescued from the river or the border, from the Juarez airport, a military checkpoint just outside of Juarez, and migrants arriving on trains. The camp will have hot water, showers, porta potties, and a dining room. It will be split into three different sections for three different family groups. And this new temporary facility will be able to host up to 300 migrants and is set to be open for the next two months, but this can change. Reporting from Ciudad Juarez, Heriberto Perez, ABC7. And the city of Juarez will keep a record of migrants coming in and out of the shelter with personal bracelets for adults only. Mexican authorities will gather all the data to know who leaves the shelter and when.